Hey, are you looking for some great gift ideas for the Pocket 2? Well, hey, this video is for you. So many paper cuts. I did not think this through. Since we're doing a gift idea for the Pocket 2, I thought I'd enjoy a warm beverage while we do this little video. This is the nice little mug my daughter made me a couple years ago. I'm pretty sure it's made with lead paint, but uh, you know what? She gave it to me, so I'll uh, drink it with a smile. Okay, when it comes to the Pocket 2, there are no shortage of great accessories for this little camera. If you still have the Osmo Pocket, which is still a great camera, by the way, well, these gift ideas will work for that little camera as well. Of course, if you have the Osmo Pocket, it goes without saying that the new Pocket 2 would probably be the best gift for you this Christmas or holiday season. I really do think that the new upgrades and the new features of this camera make the Pocket 2 worthwhile upgrading. That's just my opinion. Now, first up is probably my favorite accessory for the Pocket, and that is ND filters. That's right. I love having ND filters and using these ND filters on this little camera. It is so helpful. It can really make your average looking footage really pop and come to life and look very, very professional. Now, you really want to have complete control of all your settings on the camera, especially your ISO and your shutter speed. Now, using ND filters won't make your stuff look fantastic unless you're using the proper settings. Now, I have a set of ND filters from Polar Pro. These are a great little set. It's just the three set. It works well. Uh, Freewell also makes really good filters for this. They're a great option as well. They're magnetic. They're easy to use. They just clip onto the camera and that's great. These will also make a very great stocking stuffer. Now we can't talk about accessories for the Pocket 2 and not mention probably the best accessory for the new camera and that being the do it all adapter. I mean, it's right there in the title, right? The do it all adapter. Now, I don't have it. I don't have the do-it-all adapter. I got the more basic uh, model uh, because for me, I don't really see a need for it, especially right when it came out. I already have a bunch of accessories for the Pocket 2. However, it is a great adapter and it will give you Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, a mic jack, a whole bunch of other things. You can also get the wireless microphone, which will work with the do-it-all adapter. That's got to be one of my favorite parts. Now, I already have a very good wireless microphone system, so that's one of the reasons I decided not to upgrade and get the do-it-all uh, adapter accessory, but if you're looking for something like that, that is a fantastic option. Okay, let's open up our next gift idea and see what it is. Now, this is a great idea for the Pocket 2. It's a tripod mount or specifically a camera mount for your Pocket 2. It'll work with the Osmo Pocket as well. Now, one of the many things that was missing from the original Osmo Pocket was a simple tripod mount. You had to buy an additional accessory to make it work with your camera. Well, the Pocket 2 comes with a simple tripod adapter on the bottom of the camera, kind of hard to get on and off, but otherwise it's a perfect idea. Now, the next step is a camera mount like this. Ideally, with a tripod mount and a cold shoe mount that you can attach an external microphone to. Now, I recommend one like this. This is from Ulancey. Uh, full disclosure, I was given this for free, but I wasn't paid or anything, but I really do like this one. Um, but there are a lot of good companies out there making them. Uh, Polar Pro makes one. Scotty makes a couple mounts um, that are very, very good. I like uh, this mount because it's simple. It protects the camera. It's hard plastic, and it's got a couple cold shoe adapters and a couple uh, GoPro mounts if you want to attach it to a selfie stick or an external uh, selfie rod or something like that. And if you want to vlog with it, it really works well. And it's uh, something simple, but it will protect your camera and make it a little bit more useful. Okay, let's move on to the next one. It's in a very nice box. Look at that box. It's very impressive. Kind of don't want to open it. Let's take a look. Ah, earlier we were speaking of mics and how having a simple external mic for your Pocket 2 is a great thing to have. Now, the Pocket 2 has come a long way when it comes to audio. It now has four Microphones on that little camera on that body and the sound is so much better than the original Osmo Pocket. Now, perhaps you don't need an external microphone because the audio does sound pretty good in camera, but I always like to have an external microphone. This one here is from Rode. It's the Micro Mini and it's an inexpensive mic and it's perfect for the Pocket 2. It's lightweight and it does not need a battery to power the mic, which is a big deal. The microphone is surprisingly good. I would actually choose this over some of the more expensive roads. I've used them and I really, really like this. It's so simple to use. 
It's fantastic. It's small, lightweight, easy to use, perfect. Now, if you're gonna use this, you're gonna have to get the audio adapter from DJI, which kind of sucks, but a lot of people would have invested in that if they had the pocket too. So if you wanna invest in this and get a microphone that'll work really, really well in the wind and in most conditions, I would recommend the Rode Micro. It's uh, kind of cute too, isn't it? Kind of, if it was red, it would be like Rudolph's nose a little bit. Yeah, that was a bad joke, sorry. Okay, let's see what's next. Oh, look at this bag. Maybe it's a, maybe it's a bottle of booze. Ah, oh, it's even better than a bottle of booze. Now, this is something that I always recommend for anyone getting in the filming, whether you're shooting with a pocket or another camera. You need a decent small tripod. Now, this one here is from Manfrotto, and it's a great small tripod. You can change the size of it. You can adjust the tripod head to whichever direction you like, and it will work in any direction, and that's great. Now, the Pocket 2 works really, really well on this tripod. It's excellent for shooting time lapses or for motion lapses, and I actually like using it almost as an extension rod when you're shooting uh, vlogging style with it. You can hold it out there and get the shot that you want. Now, of course, the Pocket 2 has a wider field of view, which makes it really easy to vlog with it. But for me, this is just something simple and long enough that I can hold it up just far enough away to get the shot that I want. Because sometimes I find the shot a little bit tight, even with the Pocket 2. It's much better than the Osmo Pocket, but sometimes I like to have a little bit of an extension to get it out there. Okay, now we're going to the stocking for this next one here. Hope it doesn't disappoint. Ah, this is also a good one. Now, you just bought all your accessories for the camera. You're ready to go with the Pocket 2, but you need somewhere to store the camera and all those accessories. Well, you need to get yourself a carrying case. Now, this little carrying case is fantastic. It holds the Pocket 2 and a bunch of your accessories. It's a great little case. It's hard, it's small, it's lightweight. It's got a zipper, it's very, very strong, and it'll get the job done. Now, if you have more accessories, you might wanna get a bigger case, but if you're just starting off with a Pocket 2, start with something small and then slowly build up from there. This one here is very good. You can find it on Amazon. Very, very simple design and I like it a lot. Ah, that's delicious. It's like Christmas in a mug. Well, I better wrap things up here as I still have some gift shopping to do. I always leave it to the last minute. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope it helped you decide on some great gift ideas for your Pocket 2. And if you don't already have the Pocket 2, Let's hope that Santa leaves you one under the tree. That's if you've been good and not naughty. Anyways, thanks for watching. I really appreciate you taking the time. Have a happy holiday. Merry Christmas. Whatever you celebrate, enjoy some time with your family, hopefully. And uh, we'll see you next time. It really is good. Normally, it's, it's quite bad, but it's quite good. Okay, so that puts a wrap on this video. You get it, wrap? Now, my wife is pretty pissed off at me that I used up her, uh, her good wrapping paper, so I'm going to have to uh, tape it back together somehow. Um, yeah, I'm not really sure how that's going to work. And, um, yeah, anyways, uh, wish me luck this holiday season.